And you just imagine all that energy that you're pushing through your hands, through the portal of your hands, pushing it off. I can feel it. It's about to fall. TikTok conspiracy theorists. One of, if not my favorite form of personal entertainment on the internet. Because, well, to be honest, they always kind of make me feel better about myself. And you know what? Today is no exception because we are visiting one of our favorite conspiracy theorists on this channel, Alex Serves Tea. Believer in many conspiracy theories such as the sky is a giant TV screen or that the government is hiding our true potential from us and preventing us from going out into space to meet the mantis people no i am not joking that is an actual theory but today we're moving a bit away from conspiracy theories and diving into more of just the ideas of what the human body is capable of now look the human body is a crazy miraculous thing i mean we can make pee out of our blood who thought of that fall down scrape your knee don't worry it'll grow back we can do some pretty crazy things as humans that we just kind of ignore because well, we're human, so we're used to it. One thing that uh, I'm gonna have to say I don't think humans can do, however, is move things with your mind. Now, the idea of telekinesis is nothing new, but I feel like most people these days are not really buying into stuff like that. But as I'm sure you've already figured out, Alex Serves Tea does not see it that way. Matter of fact, she doesn't just believe in telekinesis, she believes she possesses the power of telekinesis. And we're gonna see some very convincing videos today that, you know what, might just change our minds. Let's begin. Please subscribe. Okay, I'm like having too much fun with this, so I want to do it again. And um, so if you're going to do it and you're going to use like a crystal like this, don't lay it flat because it doesn't really give it room to fall over because um, it's it's flat, so it's a higher, uh, heavier density. So um, I stood it up so that it has room to be able to topple over you know um okay already have some doubts uh, if you could really move a rock with your mind why would it need to be in an easier position to fall over also that's that's not how density works if you're gonna move a rock with your mind i want it to be like a boulder not something balancing on your other hand that you can just move and make it fall over i mean seriously the scariest part is not that this tiktok exists it's that there's hundreds of comments buying into it and thinking that when eventually this rock does fall over it was actually telekinesis that's horrifying. Okay, and so then, let's see if you guys can see. Okay, I'm gonna put it like, right? Can you guys see? Okay. And then you just imagine putting all of your energy because your hands are a portal. Oh, wow, that's news to me. I've never had something in my hand that just mysteriously goes missing. What? Where is this portal leading to? The shadow realm, a random McDonald's? I mean, seriously, that, that is a big question. Where do my hand portals lead and how do I find out? Putting all of your energy into your hand and imagine pushing the crystal off with your energy. It's just a transfer of energy. And you just keep imagining. I can feel it moving already on my finger on my fingertips, and I'm not moving my hand, okay? You know, here's the problem with that. We can literally see your hand bobbing up and down. Like, you can't just say something and have it be true. You have to actually back it up somehow. If I can see your hand moving and you tell me it's not moving, I'm not just gonna be like, oh, <laughs> guess I need to schedule an eye appointment. Like, no, no, I see your hand moving. But I can feel it lifting off of my fingertips. It's getting lighter. It's getting lighter. Okay, and then you're just going to imagine, concentrate, and only think about moving the crystal off of your fingertip, falling off of your fingertip onto the bed. And you just imagine all that energy that you're pushing through your hands, through the portal of your hands, pushing it off. I can feel it, it's about to fall. All this is proving to me is that even if this was actual telekinesis, it has no actual application in the real world. If you're having to work this hard on moving a little rock, it would take you like 15 years to move anything of actual size. Kinda lame. You pushing it off, keep going.
it's about to fall. I can feel it. Can you guys see it moving? I don't know if you guys, I have my, I've had my eyes closed, so just keep going. Let me concentrate for a second because I'm talking and it's distracting me, but I can feel it moving. Oh my god, just make the rock fall already. I'm not gonna lie, I haven't actually finished this video yet. I just saw the premise, I was like, okay, yeah, no, I've got to talk about this. It would be hilarious if the rock just never falls. There it goes, there it goes, keep going. It's going, and there it goes. Isn't that awesome? I just want everybody to sit here and think for a moment that there are adults who watched this video just like we did start to finish, saw the process, saw the telekinesis at work, opened up the comments, and left a comment about how they thought this was real. You do with that information what you will. Okay, so I have been trying to communicate telepathically with Danny. And um, I actually did the other day, so I'm going to attempt it again. I've got a little treat for her here. And so let's see if she um, can hear the thoughts in my head. Good girl, she did everything I just said. I said, stay, okay, come, sit, and lay down. What? Not gonna lie, not the strongest argument I've ever heard. If you had a dog that when you waved a treat in front of their face and slowly walked away from them, they didn't slowly follow you, you know, like a dog would, I think I'd be slightly worried. And I mean, you can say you were thinking anything. If you told us what you were gonna think before it happened, okay, that would be better. But still, this is just what a dog would normally do, I think. Even if it's not what your dog would normally do, you could have a hand off in the distance having doing like hand signals. I don't know how well you're dog is trained. I mean, I can go on the street and wait for a car to pass and say, well, look at that. I was thinking I want a car to pass. That must mean I'm telepathic. Like, no, that's not how it works. So this is just another TikTok I'll have playing in the background while I talk about a few more things. It's funny how these conspiracy theorists always pick things very carefully. Like, I cannot technically prove that her hand is moving in this video, but we all know that it is. I mean, we can see it. We can't definitively say that the hand moving made the rock fall, so that's why she does this. Just like we can't say that the dog wasn't actually listening to her thoughts even though we know it wasn't like meet me in person and make me slap myself in the face then i'll believe you but seriously the fact that so many people believe this kind of stuff is genuinely horrifying well what do you guys think are these tiktoks concrete evidence that telekinesis really does exist really hoping you said no to that question by the way but hey no pressure i mean i guess to be fair out of all the theories we have covered from alex this is i guess the most believable but given the other theories that really means nothing. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and walk on over to that subscribe button and touch it. It's free. It won't cost you anything. But for now, that's all I have for you today. Bye. Subscribe.